Hey folks, welcome back to Ostrov. Boy, does it look cold out there. All of these chimneys going, trying to stay warm. Yeah. Whoa. Okay. Make a little noise on me. I've got some wagons down there. But yeah, this is a cold looking landscape right now. We're toward the end of January. I let it run for a while. Get warehouses built and stocked up and started want to get this area grown up a little bit too and this dropped in and and uh employed and they're making what they need to i decided to put just a little bit of bark and firewood in each of these just so that if we i think bark is mostly used well besides the the asheries bark is mostly just used for the tanneries out of here but we're not really running this guy much anymore are we um, we've got a few more logs to go. So once this goes down, though I never see you with bark, why is that? You're there. Hmm, I'm waiting firewood, so waiting for a partner. No, the log is on its own. Oh, okay, so we never have a log over here, that's why. Okay. Anyway, this episode we should get back to building the last of our row houses. And working over here... I have set up some more cards. This one needs to go away. Um, that was supposed to have been delivered to somewhere. Let's see here. What do I want? Let's take you up like so until somebody brings this cart back. What are you doing with it? You're bringing clay over to the brickworks. I've taken some of the employees out of the brickworks because we are close to enough bricks already to do the last of our, what, three row houses left? So we're almost done with those. So slowed that down. I'm waiting for him to return. So I can hire off one more laborer to haul that cart away. Come on. Somebody take the job. Who is that? Marifa is here. Oh, come on, guys. <laughs> oh, well. I'll keep it there at the 200 mark. And at some point, someone's going to snag that. They're going to deliver it out over there somewhere where it's needed. Anyway, um, let's go deal with Marifa, then get back to the the Grand Tour. What do we got going on here? Carts have been coming in and out, and just slow things down a little bit. What was still waiting for us? Dirkachi is waiting for 3,000 more apples, and they've got all of their shoes. So just 3,000 more apples going on, and it's, it's there. So we are, we're good. Um, Sallow is left over. I'm pretty sure that was supposed to have been sold and it didn't. So let's get that uh, out of the system and eaten. Yeah, so 3,000 apples ordered in a bunch more metal parts to get carts going. And um, Marifa, how much time do I have? You are over here, 22 days. I, all last episode, we were having trouble getting the wagons repaired. And when I... After I did a little bit more, you know, a couple months worth of work in here and then checked them, they still were all, you know, dead in the water. The carts were not being repaired, or the wagons were not being repaired at all. And now that I've turned the game off, turned it back on again, we're all up and running. So it might have been more of a reporting issue. I didn't actually go down here and see if they were all parked. I don't remember doing that. So it may be that they were being used and I just didn't. You know, it was reporting it improperly. But, yeah, everything is suddenly working just fine. So, just one of those things you just got to, you know, turn off, turn it back on again. So, I think we're fine in that regard. And I do like these. I'm kicking around the idea of maybe bringing on a third. But before I do, I decided to put a cart shed over here to assist with the charcoal system. So, we can get five employees purposely moving carts in and around through this system and I don't know how they choose their job if it is by you know vicinity these guys will concentrate on these jobs or if it's still whichever job comes up in town the first cart that's available no matter where it's from goes there I don't know how intelligent the game is in that regard so I've not really thought about that before. But little by little we are getting... What do we got sitting around here? So these two are bringing back. There's 10,000 sitting there. We got 78 there, 0 there. And bringing back. And what is... 
or is not happening here. You are buying food, so you're not employed right now. Okay. So there is that, or they could come up here and just get it directly from here. And firewood, there's 15,000, 1,200 reserved. The idea was to, to save the steps, but you know, whether you're hauling it from here to a warehouse or here to a charcoal, I guess it's roughly the same. So either way, it will work. Over here, we got a little bit more distance. Where are you? You're kind of hiding in the snow. You're sitting up there, and you're starting to make fire, whether they're claiming it almost as fast as they can make it. Um, number of trees. There are no trees right now, and that's because they got the job of clearing the new field over here. So they're doing a lot of walking right now instead of just dropping trees. So that's going to be a little bit of a problem for a while. So once this is finally cleared out, then we should see the efficiency spike over here. But yeah, we've got no, uh, we've got no logs for a little while. Um, so two fields over here of sunflower. We'll do this one this year. This one will be sunflower next year, and we'll trade out the fallows and set them for. So plow this field. Don't plow. Yeah. So set this for no plow. And we'll see if it can regain 100%. Sunflower, unfortunately, needs 100% of red. So will it get all that back without plowing from just sitting fallow? Or not? So we'll see. We may have to stick fallow in there. I don't know. Or uh, plowing in there. I don't know. Anyway, I'll, we'll find that out. Um, what else did I do in between? I kind of roamed through some of the buildings and checked things checked uh, you know, labor and, and who's employed and what months usually when I'm playing these episodes I'm going so fast I can't keep track of each individual building so I took some time and just kind of roamed the whole city and reevaluated some things oh trees are going down here good make this look a lot better so these guys are bringing in lots of logs we're up to zero <laughs> never mind <laughs> So they're turning it into firewood as fast as they can. We are at February. So I guess we're going to keep everybody working until I see a glut. The problem is they're still only going to go to 18, then they're going to quit. So it's just we're not there yet. We're grabbing firewood as fast as we possibly can. So, and they're having to walk a little bit to go get it, but I guess it's about the same as I'm making them walk over here. I didn't want them to strip their own area completely. I wanted to, to, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll strip mine a little further away. Yeah, we'll kind of hide it behind a, a few, uh, decorative trees to make it look like the forest is, you know, whole and pristine. <laughs> That's how it tends to be done out there in the real world anyway. Um... Okay, so oh, Marifa, then I can speed things back up again. So you're over here. Our last of our apples are about done. Good. So you, Marifa, right there. Oh, you're up. Okay. I see this void over here in my peripheral vision. Think, okay, I gotta. I haven't clicked yet, but it's down here. Um, wheat. Where are we looking at? We're at 44. Uh, that's probably going to make us to it till time to uh, uh, harvest again. I think so. Hemp in the system, we got about a thousand. We have lots of flax, so I'm not going to worry about that. Is flax listed? It is. We got 22, so we got 3,000 for textiles. So we're fine there. Honey, just out of curiosity, about 1,500. Okay. Textiles, we got quite a few. Well, we've got. I, I went through, and when I was going through all the buildings. I did things like decided to make this guy only warm clothes and this one only regular clothes. So textiles being shoved around and vacated out of the other one and, and moved into warehouses and things like that. So it's going to be a, a little bit of a shuffle for a while, but went through to see what I could do to increase the efficiency here and there. Just realized I never got into these guys. So for 47, 69, and still 600 in the system. Okay. So you can still go up one more month. Let's take you into March. No, let's take you into November. We'll still leave you guys off these two months to assist. 
but we'll make you November as well. That should work. Okay, so we should we have a little extra wool. We'll do that. Back to Marifa. So I was looking at textile. That's what set me off on a wild goose chase here. So broadcloth, we're fine. More close horses. Okay. Sunflower. That's right. You want to buy from us. Dried fish. Wow. We're doing great with dried fish. And yeah, like I said, I think that's why we have so little salt. We're doing really good with dried fish. Let's get rid of the whole thing. Sure. $39.88. Let's do that. Dried. $39.88 and temporary you. I did take charcoal and salt out of the trader until we get these uh, deficiencies figured out. There's no point in stockpile the, those large numbers for no purpose at all since I wouldn't be selling them anyway. Um, dried fish sunflower oil, we're at twenty-one fifty. We should be able to get most of this done before we get into March. Yeah. Let's do two let's do one thousand of you. Sunflower oil. Yeah, let's do that. One thousand of you deal. Right there. What else would you like? What else should we sell? Buckwheat, 5,000. Flour, 14. Sallow, 6. Eggs. We're still floating in you know, just enough for ourselves. Got 30 horseshoes floating around. Salt, we're in the 5,000s again. Good. I did take storage down in a lot of places where I had stuck 2,000 here and 2,000 there for up around the tannery and what have you. Didn't think we needed that much out there. So that's there's a, a few, there's a bit more kind of floating about now. Um, iron, where are we? We're less than 1,000. Metal parts, we bought some last time at the very end, I think. So I think we're sitting pretty good here. Yeah, let's call this one done. All right, so you guys are bringing all this stuff over. Need, the thousands already brought in, fifth, or called. 1,500, you need to leave, you need to leave. Where do we have metal parts stored? And did I want to increase that? And that reminds me. So a cart shed needs to go in, and I think we're now needing another carpentry since we're now kind of pretty heavily cart-based on our charcoal system more so than we were before so let's get another source of preventative maintenance going in a, in a third part of the map here way up there and way over here it just seems reasonable um, so we could store some more parts out there what do we have going on we have a hundred so 5,000 and 100, we can store 8,000 out here. Okay, well let's... Mm. You know, I'm going to leave it at 100. We usually float around at, you know, 300 available. If I put 200 in each one, we may end up with 200 in this one and zero in another one. So, yeah, let's, let's not tap that that hard. Okay, so we're done over here. I was just questioning these. We're good. Okay. We have a lot of onions to sell. So waiting for, oh, I guess March to get here and get into, I'm thinking these guys for onions. So let's fire this up, get this moving again. We're about to go into March. Everyone's going to lay off and start uh, planting fields and planting hops. And didn't even see that last time. Spent that whole episode went from a sowing to a harvesting and never even got to look at it. I did notice it a couple times off in the distance and you can see them all growing then you can see them all gone so it worked the way the way I've got it set up two months with three people in each month for sowing and for harvesting seems to be doing pretty good you can go away now so you let's grab those building materials uh, right in there and Two carts and a cart shed, and then this guy up in here. I think that's all we're going to allocate to these guys. I've got kind of the same thing, three of them. One, one's going in there, one's going in there. 
So there'll be three sets of, there'll be 12 carts available for this area or whoever needs to grab something. Yeah, I'll think about that. We may only stock two of them and see if the third one's truly needed or not. Where are we on charcoal right now, by the way? Charcoal, we're still floating in there. Oh, but one just finished, so you know, it bounces 10,000 per dome as soon as they finish. And we've got actually several domes going. So there's 20,000 more about to pop. So that's good. And I've been watching this as I was waiting for these things to build. And we've been making it about as fast as we've been using it. Meaning the blacksmith should have quite a bit in them. Charcoal, yeah, there's 2,800 there. You have got... Where am I? Warehouse. You've got 3,200. Uh, cart shed. You guys are sitting on... You're only allowed to... You only have room for a thousand, if I remember right. Charcoal, a thousand. That's ten thousand in here. Water. We could push that a little harder. Um, what did I click on before? It was right there. So we have space for five thousand charcoal in this area. Cart shed. Which one were you? Uh, demolished cart parking. So I don't know. Slow down. Where am I? There. Completed. Oh, cart shed, not cart parking. Okay. So let's hire you guys up. No, let's get... Yeah. Hmm. Curious. I'm going to take a little inventory here and just kind of see the condition of our carts. Can I order five of those? Wagons are still fine, though they're all going to go down at the same time, unfortunately. They all got rebuilt, or the, the system reset and acknowledged them all at the same time. I don't know which one it was. But, yeah, all the timers are, have been reset to the same moment. So that's not going to be good when that finally goes down. Um, anyway, carts in general. How are we kind of doing out there? You... Got you over there. There's three of them out over here. Got two that we haven't put in yet. Uh, the other one's right there. We got two that we put in over here. Okay. Not bad. I don't see anything that's actually down. Now we've taken... We took some from here. That's right. In fact, there may be a couple others we've taken some from. Okay. Okay. Well, in that case, I'd say I can go ahead and order all five of these, and I think we'll be fine. Get those built. And get a worker in here. Let's get one worker in there, just because I'm going to forget all about that and not hire anybody until it's too late. So you guys are still filling. Charcoal is probably still floating in that. Yeah, 0 to 10, 0 to 10, 0 to 10. And that'll be fine until we really get this up and going. Um, exclamation point... You guys, forestry, you dropped down because I had set you assuming that you would be putting in more logs than than we can handle and just sitting there twiddling your thumbs. But it's not going to work. We're not going to be that way for a while. Not until this is gone, seven more trees, and you've started buzzing around here. Then I'll meter you guys back. Okay, um, firewood over here, 44, 693, you just got here. Okay, so firewood, 10,000 of you, and I was setting you guys for 1 and 2, 1, 2, 3, 1, 2. So 2 people will be coming in one month before August and September when everybody's laid off to work on farms to kind of pre-fill it and then one month before everyone's off in March working on on farms and they tend to work on charcoal about that same time too so you guys are plowing this is sowing there's somebody walking in there but I don't get a sense you're just starting okay so you are the only one everything else here will require uh, plowing. Okay. So, let me see that. That's you. There we go. So you got a bunch of folks over there. And only because I've limited you to that. 
Same thing. I didn't put any limits over here, and wow. <laughs> You're doing it. So, should I limit these guys? I probably should. Let's think about that. Where, where do I want to go here? Uh, this one. So, the other one, I've taken you back to, like, 16? Let me see that. What do I do there? 20. What do I do here? 20. So, I took all the limits away. And said, just, just do it. Okay. It's I guess that's all the space that was available for the the field that was there. I see. Hmm. This one I don't want to limit. There's so much to do. I don't know. Maybe we'll just let it self-regulate, see how that goes. But this would be a great time to get a lot of extra work in here doing firewood too. But the whole point is to get the farms going. Get our best crops. So it's, it's, it's a tough balance in between. Meanwhile, we are still, you know, there's 20,000 sitting there and another 20,000 sitting there in one stage or another. So I think we're fine. Okay. Um, all this will alleviate a little bit more, of course, when these three buildings go in. And the idea of putting some houses over here was kind of predicated upon getting rid of this and opening this up a little bit you could still be there we could get two in here and two in here with you split in the middle in fact we can aim you a little bit better that way too let's play with that what does the house look like over here uh, spin you around and do that so you Something like... I don't know how far up I've got to go. You seem to be kind of happy there. Okay. Don't know that I like it. Up against these buildings now. Don't know that I like the look. But it, I guess a single house looks really funny. But I guess a string of them through here. And even up around here a little bit. Now, how far can I go? I'm, I'm going to be fine for a while. Yeah. So this one, let's make you a pathway directly into that guy. That's the path they're going to want to take. Take you a little further. And a little bit more off the, the shore. In fact, you drop off really hard right there. Let's. That might look kind of weird. Okay, you're going to be in there. Spin you around a little bit more, and actually, you would, well, you probably want to be looking at the, at the water. It's a long walk. I, would, I guess I could have, I can't still do that. Um, F, no, just the house. Okay, so I can't get you over to here. That would have been better. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Hindsight. Okay, do that again. Right there, and what are we doing? We're at one speed and we're in march. Let's speed things up. Okay, so you're gonna go there instead. And right there. Now the cart parking is done. So slow back down again in F1. So you're gonna be more like that, or like that. Up in there. And I guess a main road that travels into here into like a little cul-de-sac could do that and head out yeah maybe so now you turn toward the water I kind of like that now do I angle you just a little bit sure okay enter you what I wanted to find out was how far away can I go uneven terrain Ooh. Okay, we'll spin you to match the terrain. Okay, we can make these happen. We're still not getting any warnings as far as too far away. There we go, market stalls. Market stalls. So the, the grass area should be fine. Okay, where was that cart parking? Some far oil just sold. You're over here. What happened to this one? Kind of thought that was going to build first. 
Yeah, you're empty, big time. I don't want to build carts right now anyway until I know that this has been satisfied over here and then we've got a few more repairs done here and there. Three carts are done. Are you guys in there? They're going actually pretty quick. So, all right, I'll put all five of you in there. Regular deliveries as well. Okay, Dracachi has get you taken care of. Then we'll work on some more houses again. I'm tempted to kick these houses in before the row houses. I think they can get them done pretty fast and give us a little more you know, able bodies over there. Dracachi, you are over here. And what does Dracachi mean when there's no charcoal to sell? You're in here. You're our same trader meaning the same laborers that are still finishing the other orders are going to have to deal with yours too. You will sell to us salt. We don't need it. Lime, leather, we're fine. Metal parts, we're fine. Iron, iron ore, pigs, cows, horses, sallow, dried fish, and potatoes. We're good. You want our wheat? No. You want our shoes? I could do that. Do 1,500 to you. Will you take 17? Let's do the 17. Interesting, I can't click on this one to fill that in. Um, add another zero and it'll do it. There we go. 1784, deal. Shoes. Where am I at? Right there. 1784. And temporary you. Apples, for some reason, apples get stuck. I don't quite know why that is. Dracachi... Shoes, buckwheat, we've got lots, probably have too much. We've got a bunch coming in, well, in six months. We're only feeding chickens with it. Let's get rid of 2,000 just to empty some warehouses somewhere. 2,000 deal and buckwheat, 2,000. And do that. Okay. Um, what else do you want? Chicken, eggs, sunflower, oil. We've already done that. We'll let that build up a little bit more. Clothes are fine. Honey is fine. Apples. We're going to be hurting on apples. So we actually are using a lot more apples than I give them credit. So i got to keep that in mind and leave a, a couple thousand, not just a thousand for us. Harilka, we're at 400, so we're slowing down over there. I slowed them way down because they were making it so fast. So let's peek into their distillery. What have we got you guys doing? Basically two all the time. And you only use, what was it? Just water and, okay, wheat, two months, then distill, batch. Um, water and wheat is all I'm really getting out of that. Okay, and two batches. So if we go to three batches, that would be enough, just water and wheat. We, we went to smaller batches and we cut the batches down. We were at, I think, two and 500. So this is in between those two settings. We'll see how this goes and see how that builds up. Okay, so speaking of, how's our brewery going? I'm going slow, so Dukachi shouldn't run out before too long. There's beer, how much beer is out there? Beer, there's 3,100. We have lots of beer. Can we sell beer? There was somebody who would buy beer. Who was that? Seems like I remember seeing that. It's not you guys. You and Hiroka. Okay. There's somebody I'm pretty sure that buys beer. So close, honey. This is all good. Yeah, we're done here. Okay. And so beer, we'll let that go like it is. How much hops are in the system? We're halfway through our year and there's still 5700 hops okay so we could kick this up to three as well we could all right let's try that beer storage 5,000 each hmm this might get a little tight but we do have a little more room elsewhere so you've got a space we could put uh, backup beer over here in case the quantities get beyond what 
what I had planned. Something like that. We'll see how that goes. You are not take from other granaries because this one is in order to get beer up into this area. Right there. So up in here, we've got we got no meat in the system right now. You got 500 of the other two, and you got wheat being stored up here for the windmills. Okay. Now charcoal, just kind of keep an eye on that. We're up to 16,000 there. Okay. I can speed up again. What's the exclamation point? You need to know what we're gonna do. We're gonna wait and get this this guy filled in first. And we're going to see how you're doing. There's only one left. Okay. And then we'll give it time for some carts to be repaired for a while. Then we'll start building more carts over there. Um, you guys... Yeah, that really worries me. This guy's going to go down first. I could force this guy to be done sooner. But is there really an advantage to that? I mean, that just means I'll have only five down at the same time instead of six. But... I don't know. Okay. Speed things back up again and let things continue as they were. Somebody has the flu. Do you have logs? You don't. Do you... You have five left over there, then we start having logs. You guys don't have logs either. Five guys running non-stop. Um, you got one last long-distance tree. Then you're going to start doing your thing over here. Okay. Anyway, let's... Did this not... Oh, there you are. I thought, what? <laughs> Did I lose it? <laughs> okay. You're going to be there. So the carpentry... Goes in or the housing goes in. Let's make the housing go in first. Okay, let's do that. Another house. And on the side this time. And let's turn you like that in F1. You can be there, you can be there, and narrow path, we'll have to get too crazy with that, and you can be up here a little bit. So let's think about that, come up a little bit higher, and a little bit higher. Yeah, kind of throttle this road here a little bit, yeah. Okay, so you're there, and can I flip you? Place is occupied. Okay. So you need to be just the tiniest little bit right there. Okay. So I can turn you this way. And appearance wise, let's rotate you more like that. Maybe just a little bit more. Okay, you're there. That way these guys have their their front windows looking out on the water. Um so we'll get both of you guys built next. I think so. I wonder how, you know, are these row houses, I think, have four families in them. I wonder how long it takes to build a, yeah, four families in there. Although we got the cart, cart there. Is that this one? That's this one. Four families. Okay. So I wonder how long it takes labor-wise to build, does it say? I've never really stopped to look. Do I have any kind of account for labor? We have account for all the materials. But not, not a real sense of how many swings of the hammer it takes. Can I build four of these guys as fast as I can build one of those guys? That's what I'm curious about. Uh, you go into here and you turn... Hmm... Debating. Is this our last house? This will cement the road. If I get it up in there. Let's go that way. Okay, so you're heading up a little bit off the shore a little bit. And like so. Um, April. What I didn't think to do last time was to check out the markets or the granaries to see how our supplies are doing. Can we do a bunch more houses without gardens? Or is this the wiser move to put these gardens in? Do I put some more singles in here? Or do I not? You kind of merge funny over there. Hmm. Just thinking out loud here. Let's put you like so. Car parking is completed. 
enter. Let's go deal with that one. You guys are done. Turkachi again. Okay, you guys are done. You're up and running. Um, exclamation point. You're probably a labor thing. Did we just rehire? I think we did. Yeah. Everyone's kind of coming back to work now. So you need carts. I'm not seeing any other exclamation points in regard to carts have all broken. So I think I can go ahead and... Yeah, let's do it. Let's, well, yeah, let's, yeah, go for it. I was going to say just, just do two, but nah. We'll doom somebody else in order to get them up and running. Yeah. Um, or hopefully, if there were carts that need to be repaired, they've already jumped into the queue. I don't know if this supersedes that or not. Let's see about putting one more house in here and just see what this looks like. Do I make a tiny one? Give them just a little bit of a front yard? Or do we call this finished? So let's roll you sideways and take this down like so. And like that, bring you into here, put you into a corner? Maybe. Something like that. And I can touch right there. Just picturing the road right there. The road here coming in. I th think that works. Kind of tapers in and around. Do we want to be this close to this fence though? Maybe a more like something like that. Hmm. You're going to pull into there no matter what I do. They're going to clip this corner and go up. So may as well take full advantage of that. And you're going to be like so. Or do you match this guy? I think you match this guy. Alright, we'll call you done. You live there. And let's get four of these going. And then we'll get into the row houses again. And we can set, I think... A little cul-de-sac right here since they'll still reach the uh, the market and it'll give us a little more food variety you are still sitting on some good numbers here though you are though not a lot of variety I mean yeah we're, we're down to dried fruit and peas and garlic and what have you that's enough it gives us more than the three minimum that we need for variety around the place. Finished a field. Okay, so you are going to be fallow. Uh, where's fallow? There you are. And then sunflower. And... Though I've got to see just how that works. Is it going to cycle? No, this is still this year. So, activate. Okay. This is still this year. You guys all just went walking. What you do? Oh, you're chopping trees. Okay. That's weird, but you're still doing it. <laughs> Probably because I just activated it and it reset something. All right, so you eventually get carts. I'm pretty sure. We're waiting. We've already built them? That is the one, right? That is the one. We've already built those. Okay. I mean, I, I did load these up to maximum employees. Nothing ordered. Repairing. Going to work. Repairing. So we are doing things. Okay. Uh, here. Nothing ordered, but supplying, supplying, taking a rest, taking a rest. So let's... Supplying, you're going to get back and you're going to get new orders because you still have some blue bar left. You are supplying. No, you're still emptying your cart. Yeah, you're going to run out of blue bar. Okay, you're going to take this cart back to there and have a tiny bit of blue bar left. Now you got to go check in. You're going to take a rest. Okay, I want to see if you guys are going to be doing any... You're just supplying resources. So nobody's working on carts over here. 
are there carts yet to work on? So repairing, repairing, going to work, and taking a rest. Let's check out going to work real quick. Though you might also be running out there to get more boards. That's possible. But it looks like I could quite possibly order another load of carts. I think so. You are working. You're just sitting around doing nothing. Okay. That was my answer. So grab all of these. Check the wagons one more time. Ooh, we're there. So I won't order any more. There's still a few places I could put carts, but I'll wait. This is going to hit about the time all those carts get finished. And we'll see if they actually repair them this time. We know we have enough workers and we have enough parts in play to make that happen. All right, how are we doing after all this time on charcoal? Hovering in the 20s. We were 16 last time. So we're kind of there. You've got 28, you've got none, and you've got 37. So they are kind of being delivered. You are bringing wood. 1,000 wood. You are a cart shed. So you're just hauling wood around. To probably storage up here? No, you're delivering to the carpentry. Okay, good. So up in here, you guys are all kind of doing what? Just out of curiosity, you're all doing. That's good to see. There's only one cart not in action. Okay, you are just bringing stuff and doing stuff. <laughs> you are on your way to... Uh, buckwheat and or salt. You're probably picking up salt to go take it to somewhere else. Okay, so that's all working. How are we on firewood down here? 10,000, 10,000. They're being delivered. Wait, that was a zero. I'm reading the wrong thing. I'm reading this. Never mind. There's a 10,000. There's a zero. And you are off to go get some. Okay. And you got 67, you've got zero, you are taking a rest, and you'll be able to get some and or somebody else will come in and do it for you or with you. And you are trying to fill up, you've got, you're bringing 600 and 200 is already reserved and being hauled out to right there, okay? So you came to do your 200 and you're going home. That part's a little frustrating with laborers. No, you are... You're off to your next labor job. Is that what I'm getting? You're now doing... Oh, you went there to go get charcoal. Okay. No? 5,000? Where are you? I don't know. I've lost you. Trying to figure out what they're all up to. Sometimes it's, it's just a mystery. Houses are going in rather quickly. And bricks, where are we at? We're at 27. We need 24, and we're done. So let's take you guys back to 2. And you guys back to 2. Where am I? Right there. And we just... And batch sizes down to 1. Really? Yeah, something like that. So, you guys will find Marifa. We started with Marifa, didn't we? Still waiting for a, a river trade to come through. Alright, so Marifa, anything real important here? Our wheat is down to 22. May, June, July, August. Ah, we'll be fine. Good enough. Um, honey, textile, broadcloth. Broadcloth, we're, we got that place filled with 2,000 broadcloth, if I remember right. I want to put in there. You're this one now. Broadcloth. 2,000, but there's only 300 available. Oh, okay. Well, we'll go ahead and do that just to give them something to do. We're at 24,000 in the treasury. Wow, that's moving in fast. And that's without selling any charcoal for a long time. All right, so Marifa Broadcloth. Let's bring a 1691 in. Sure. Warm clothes, horses, you want to buy our fish? No, 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 no. <laughs> OK, 
Okay, the economy has slowed down. Salt's doing better. Iron is there. Metal parts are doing good. Flax is there. I think we'll just... We've been selling kind of the same things to each of these traders that have been coming in. So we've kind of depleted our our reserves. Okay. Um, I noticed when I was in here, we've got a 20-year-old ox. Any day now, that one's going. All right, another house is done. Where am I at? I'm at 46 minutes. Let's shift gears. Which one are you? Let's do... Oh, they went and got that tree. Oh, good. There was a tree sitting right in the blue zone there. And I could not drop a bell post or anything on that thing to get rid of it. So I didn't think it was ever going to go down. It was just going to be stuck in the doorway. Let's move you in and get you going and get one of you built this episode. So that'll be two families there and four families over here. And so six more families moving in. And while I was working through and into the winter on this little area, trying to get up and running before this episode, um, somebody died, somebody emptied a house. So there's yet one more new family that had moved in. Um, watching these guys coming in, you have got charcoal. We're actually starting to put charcoal back into our storages again. I noticed they hit that charcoal first. This one, oh, we have 3,600 up here. And this one, we got 3,800 in there. Now, I don't know that I'm really using this one, but there's charcoal in here now, too. And we are 27,000 in storage. Interesting. Okay. So, the closeness, the more efficient apparently is paying off. So we're starting to see our numbers start to build up again. Good. We'll see long term what that means. We're not going to grow much more industry, so I don't see the demand or, or, uh, climbing too much higher than what we've already got. So a few more houses, debating whether to do anything in these voids or just leave them alone. And that's going to be a completed picture of a Australian town. Um, fish? Fine. So you... Yeah. You would be the last one to go in over there, and that was more for looks than anything. But still, it would look good. Yeah. Give a little more variety of jobs over on this side, too. So you got planted. You are officially fallow. Alright. And I shaped them to kind of shape the, the road up here and as soon as now that this fence is in and all this goes away we should see this solidify give us a real road up in here and who's breaking my uh, my road now well, that's probably just the old one fading away yeah I think so so dairy I was gonna check on you how have you been doing we had not enough milk to get going we have four ladies all summer long. There's 60 milk sitting there. We've got 40 milk sitting here. More coming. A lot more coming. There's 100 leaving. You are... There's 80 over here. So it's not like we're out of milk. It just has to be delivered. There's 40 sitting over here. Okay, a child is born. Where are we at right now? Whoa, we're at 499. We're about to roll into 500. Wow. I don't know what happens when that happens. Do fireworks go off? And Ewoks dance? I don't know. <laughs> um, you guys are sitting in that 100 range, so this tavern is, is running fine now. 25 a month. You are 55 a month. Ah. Now we can sell our onions. And you are 16 a month. You're actually the... Well, you have one less worker. Yeah, that's going to be that way for a while. I don't know what happens at this point. I guess... Another family moves in. That must be it. Okay, slow down. I do not want to miss this trade. I had a whole bunch of onions near rotting a while back, so it may already be too late. I don't know. But you do do onions. And... June, July... Oh, let's... 
Let's strip the town of the rest of the onions. Let's get rid of the old crop. 1746 deal. And same thing here. Onions. Now at this point, I wish I could just choose between, you know, this is how much is in the town and just click it all. 1746. It's kind of convenient to be able to click that number and have it auto-fill. Now I'm, I want more numbers available to click on. More variety. Um, you want to buy from us. How's our flower doing? Okay. Clothes. Now, warm clothes. We could do a thousand of you. Deal. Right there. One thousand. You're both temporary. Okay. And... Oh, my mouse pad slid. I was wondering why it at times wasn't moving when I thought it was moving. Okay, broadcloth. You want to buy sallow. How old is our sallow? I don't think it's very. Sallow's mostly sitting over here now. None. So you're sitting over here, which means you're brand new. Let's not worry about sallow for a while. You want to buy onions, carrots, apples. There's no apples left. There's no carrots left. No. Lime and beer. You're the beer buyer. Okay. So let's sell to you. We're making it fast. So let's sell you 3000 And deal. All right. So beer, 3000 I'm not in the right place. There's something. Warning flags are going off there. Beer, 3000 and temporary you. Was there anything from you to buy? Uh, 17 days left. Dry fish, window glass, mead. Yes, we are out of mead. Let's get three. Let's get 4,000. And deal. That's going to be distributed to quite a few places. So it won't be sitting in the trader long. Iron ore and salt. Salt, we're at 74. We've leveled off on salt now. We have. We could still put that in, or not, but we'll see. Um, is that, that, that is odd, because I actually cut the labor down on salt, anticipating this one coming online soon. So, salt works. So I got four guys. No, I guess I didn't. I was about to. I was going to go back down to two and two. Okay, so that is where we've always had it. Um, but we're not selling it, so that's the difference. When we were selling it, we weren't able to replace what we sold very quickly. Now that I'm not selling it, it's gradually starting to build back up again. Um, done with that sale, and speed things up, and let's see if we can't get you? You. Got a lot of materials to bring over. Where am I? 50-some minutes. Okay. Well, we'll just bring... We could temporarily... Where are the... The materials are all in this area. What do you say we, just for a little while, say supply for construction? There's five carts not being used. Going to work, taking a rest, going to work, working, and going to work. Working? Dude, you forgot your cart. What you doing? I heard there's some kind of a bug with this. He went home. <laughs> Taking a rest, visiting a tavern. Yeah, there was a little bit of an error going on with those guys that they don't report properly what they're doing. Speaking of reporting properly, what are we doing here? Ooh, we're being rebuilt now. Okay. Well, I'm going to say that probably was not a bug then. Or it's a random bug that only happens sometimes. But we are being rebuilt. We're in good shape. Okay. So, in that case, let's take one guy going to work repairing. One guy out of each of these so we can add them back in to the other one that I want to build over there. Supplying, taking a rest. So, three guys on now. And then we're going to get this guy built. And we'll put three guys in there. And that should even out our distribution pretty well. Alright, so you did get filled up then. So we got carts going here, we got carts going here. Um, 
two are being used. We got carts over here. And they're not all being used as fast as I thought they'd be. Which is good. That means they're just not going to be worn out as quick. Over here, there's only one sitting there. There's two sitting there. And up in there, there's three sitting there. Okay. So that's working well. Um, how are boats doing? Repair-wise. You. You. Okay. Swing into this area. Got one that's basically down. Are you employed? We are into July. You guys kick in. I, I reset you. I guess that's probably not going to work. Let's put one in the middle. I was going to say the first three months and the last three months, but that could put some dead zones in between. Yeah, okay. Um, so you're there. You're going to go repair. Going to work, going to work. You... Yeah, we got two boats going down. Just about to. Okay, this is not going to work. I'm going to have to have you guys hired the whole season. Now, you only deal with one so far. You'll be dealing with two soon. And you are fine. Maybe I can leave you with the three-on-three three off. If so much fewer... Um boats to worry about what was that last message a child was born brought in broadcloth and nothing else is a message yet okay you are overloaded with something you're waiting for another log and storage is full of firewood wow okay we do have storage here but I'm not concentrating on these guys right now I could turn them back on. I could. Firewood in the system. Where are you? Right there. 84,000. We could. Just to see if there's any overflow of laborers at the moment. Somebody fired on to all of them just like that. Wow. Okay. That's pretty active. They're all in one stage or another here. How are we over here? Uh, three are kind of being used. Less people over here. What was that last thing? Trials from born, trials from born, okay. Less people living here versus jobs now compared to the bulk of the people here. So this may be the one that gets used the least. But, yeah, okay, we'll run these guys. And see how that goes. How are you guys stacking up? Um, reasonable numbers. Okay. You are being built. Swing around this way and watch this. And actually here, not many. So tavern, going to, buying, going to. So I'm going to have three guys working here. That's about it. Is that enough to finish the job? We'll see. Um, charcoal now. 47,000. Okay, so I think crisis has been averted with this new strategy. I think we're in good shape there. Um, can't think of anything else. I got boats coming in. Anything else that has to be done before this episode ends? I don't think there is. Watch this guy. Finish. Broken a leg. I want to check up, up on that, but I'll catch him in a moment. Alright, you're finished. One family moved in. Broken a leg. Your household. It's got 78, okay. So that one that had broke a leg a while back and ran out of money. When I see broken leg or broken hand, you know, broken bones, I think I want to get in there and make sure they've got at least 30 to 40 so they'll make it. But my time is up and everybody is starting to harvest right now. Let's slow things down. Boy, everything's filling in, looking good. Yeah, all the gardens are growing. The fields are ripening. Boy, that is that's starting to look good. Look at that. One more thing. Um I've got I've got a very busy five or six days ahead of me so I might not be recording for a while 
So if I disappear for a few days, that's why. A lot of deadlines coming up on me right now. So I don't know if I'm going to be able to sneak in an episode or not. So I'll catch you at some point. Thanks for watching, folks. Bye-bye.